Hello everybody, it has been a while. For the last month I have been collaborating with some friends of mine. This is a cactus garden. For the remaining of this video, you will hear me referring to when it's one cactus as cactus. When it's many, I will say cacti. I will not say cactuses. So keep that in mind because I'm going to ask you later on. <laughs> some are going to come in different shapes and sizes. Some are going to grow very close to the ground, while others are going to grow really tall and upwards instead of sideways. You will also notice that many of them have spines on them. This is so that they can protect themselves from any predators, just any animal that might want to eat them this is how they defend themselves. My advice to you would be to never even try to touch them because it's going to hurt. I know this from experience. Cacti are desert plants, which means that they really like it here in this desert garden in El Paso, Texas. I'm going to keep writing the name of the cactus on the left corner of the video, but I don't know all of the species. So that way, if you find one that you really like and you would like to know more about it, you can reference it by name. Some of them are going to be really, really tiny, almost the size of my hand, while others can be more like the just as tall as my thumb. Others will be all the way up to my hips, and I'm a grown-up. And then others are going to be really short, but way larger than my feet. Look at that. Others will look like they are all greñudos and despeinados, like they're just hairy. But again, don't touch it, even if they look cute and cuddly. Do not trust, uh, even if you, if you trust them, even if you think that there are no thorns, there can always be spines in there. Those clusters that I'm pointing towards too, that look a little bit darker, those are where the flowers are going to come out from. Sometimes you will even see what looks like chilies or some fruit that is hanging out in there. It just looks a little bit different in color. And those are the actual seeds, which means that if you were able to collect them or pick them up from the floor, you could grow more cacti out of those seeds. Cacti are really good plants for the desert because it doesn't always rain in the desert. So to have your own cactus or grow, grow just one, you don't need to give it a lot of water actually. Oh, I want to show you this example. I visited this one plant, this one Mamilaria, I visited it for maybe three weeks, and so every time I kept seeing it, after every week, it kept growing more and more flowers, as if it, as if it had a flower crown. I thought it was beautiful. Other flowers are not as colorful as the ones that I have showed you before. In this case, this one is actually white. This one has different types of white in it while the ones next to it did not have any flowers at all. Also notice how I'm getting really close to the plant so that you can see most of the details on the plant. I don't, I try to get as close as I can to, to show the characteristics of it. You can practice this too as an artist if you were going to take a video or a photo of any plant. Just make sure that you get really close and that you are able to see it through your camera and then you can take the photo. Throughout this video I kept saying flowers, 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 but the biggest characteristic that I learned from making this video was that flowers in cacti are not actual flowers. They look like they have petals, yes, but they are not actual flowers. We can keep calling them flowers, but they do not look or act 
or have the same parts as a rose flower, for example? Leave me a comment below if you would like a video where I go into more detail explaining why they are not actual flowers. I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it and working on it and collaborating with my friends in their garden because it was really nice visiting. So um, let me know and um, I will see you next time in another video. Take care. Bye bye.